And hello, good timers. It's Andy. And Simone. And Simone. And we're gonna be starting something a little bit different now. We're gonna be branching out a little bit here on our channel and doing food reviews. Something we've always kind of done, but we've always incorporated into our vlogs. So now we're gonna do a kind of a little separate vlog just for uh, food reviews only. So decided we're gonna start up here in Northern Maine at the Dockside Tavern and Inn right here in Greenville. So it's one of the more hot spots here in Greenville. A little off, uh, off season right now we'll say so it might be a little bit slower than usual but some uh, great food in here we've had it before so we're gonna go ahead and give it a try again today for you guys and do a little review yeah. so we will see you inside the uh, dockside inn and tavern So we just finished up uh, just finished up eating over here at the Dockside Inn and Tavern in Greenville. And uh, so mom, what did you think? You had chicken fingers and french fries. They were awesome. Awesome. The fries were crispy and the chicken was not dry, so it was good. I, I agree. I think the fries were perfect. Um, they weren't fresh, unfortunately, so I can't say perfect, but they were almost they perfect. Were close. They were as close as frozen french fries can get to being perfect. Well, they got the and little breading on them. I, if you're gonna have frozen ones, those little breading yes. are good. And the breading on the chicken was fresh breading, and I think it could have used a little bit more flavor, but they were definitely moist and uh, definitely looked good. So there we go. Well, Simone, we go. I had what did I have? I had chicken wings. <laughs> yes, chicken wings. That's right. <laughs> I know there's a chicken wing shortage, but my my chicken wings were short. They were like <laughs> well. uh, they were like partridge like, wings. They were like little nugget wings. Yeah, yeah. So they're like little mini wings. <laughs> they but, lacked a little bit of flavor. They yep. had a nice crisp. Yep. And they they stayed juicy, but yeah they. They lacked a I would agree with that assessment. Yes. A little small, a little lacking in the flavor. Um, and yeah, just could have been a little bit uh, better. <laughs> yeah. Dad? I had cheesesteak. That's right. That looked nice. Which was very good. It did it look was good. The right amount of cheese with meat and the vegetables in it were the green peppers and onions <laughs> and mushrooms were excellent. <laughs> Dad, I, I gotta say, let's pass on the green peppers. The, the roll was that's how they do it, right? Very fresh and very good. 
It it did it did look good minus the green peppers. I and agree. It had homemade chips with it too. Yes, it is chips yeah, for homemade. Nice. So I'm not sure why the French fries aren't homemade, but the chips are. But either way, good homemade chips. Those good are nice and crispy. Chips, yes, very yeah. good. Yeah. And for me, I had uh, steak tips and uh, some rice pilaf. Steak tips, once again, kind of a theme going on here. We're a little on the stingy side. I think there was only six steak tips in there, to be honest with you. But um, the flavor was very good. Mm -hmm. um, they were teriyaki flavor, the same teriyaki marinade that was on the uh, chicken, but I had enough flavor on mine, thankfully. So I would say the steak tips were tender. They were very good. I could have used a few more of them, though. Rice pilaf was from a box, and um, it was wet and soggy and uh, not cooked correctly. But the flavor was okay. And once again, you could tell it's from a box. So kind of... Kind of a mixed review here. I would say uh, the stuff that was homemade was the best. Mm -hmm. The stuff that was frozen, you could tell was frozen. So, yeah, I would give it a, let's see, one out of five. Let's go three and a half, I would say. You didn't talk about the appetizers either. The appetizers, right? Yeah, yeah the appetizers. That's right, we had appetizers. Never mind, it's not three and a half yet. <laughs> All right, so yeah, the appetizers, we had onion ring nachos, basically. Uh, the barbecue sauce, coleslaw, and pulled pork on top of onion rings and cheese, obviously. Yes. And those were uh, very good. Um, Simone thought they were a little stingy again on the on the pork, which well, they may have been. It was hiding underneath. I didn't see it. But it was hiding. Once I saw it, there was quite a bit. Should yeah. have fresh. But yeah, and then we had fried pickles, which everybody at the table thought were too salty, except for me. So my taste buds obviously are not correct. <laughs> they were a little salty, so, almost like a. I think when I saw they it, were about good it more like yeah, a like a light yeah. older grease, like that kind of salty. Yeah, yeah I think like they might have been day salt. day old grease that we yeah. had everything fried in tonight, which may have explained why everything looked a little well done, but nothing actually was. Um, and yeah, so that might explain some things. But so I'm not changing my score though. It's still three and a half. I give mine a four. Mom says four. I say three and a half. Um, four. What's the four for Dad? What's the numbers? What are, what are one we, through five. One, one through five. five? Let's not make this complicated. I'd say a three. <laughs> My three. Chicken, but, but that's chicken wing shortage, but yeah, they're, they're tiny. Chicken wing shortage. Three, okay. Yeah. Uh, I mean, we have a duck. <laughs> we yeah. have a duck? Yes. Yeah. We have a duck. duck. There's yeah. a duck right here. literally right here, guys. He's looking for he, food. He, See, we have a duck. He'll what? be on the menu next. <laughs> yeah. What the duck? So tomorrow's special is duck. What the duck? <laughs> and Blaise and he's, uh, he's walking right over there to... Yep. To the fryer later, all on his own. Let's fatten that boy up. So yeah, okay. So there we go. He, we got fresh duck here at the dock side. <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna go. I guess uh, three and a half stars. So yeah, I think three and a half is good. So all I would right. suggest it. Try to get the stuff that's homemade. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, you get some better looking chicken wings, something a little larger. But yeah, I would definitely come back. As a matter of fact, I have. This is my second time. So I'd come back a third time. And it's a beautiful location. And it is. It's it a is gorgeous. beautiful location. It's actually a really nice dining room. Yeah. Um, kind of fits some of the whole main moose head theme. It's got some dead animals on the wall, things like that. So, so yeah, I would say that was a good time. Yes, I would say yes. it's a good time. So good time, good food, great company. So we'll see you guys later. Thanks for joining us. And till next time. Have a good time. Have a good time. Have a good time. Have a good time. <laughs> Let's have a drink, just relax, all your problems will fade If you're ready for a good time, count on me There's a party in the backyard, dance your problems away I'm all about the good vibes, I know you're all about the good vibes